And now NTV's Leila Mohammed, who is currently on an exchange program at a local TV station in Wisconsin in the United States, has been reporting on the anniversary of President Donald Trump's inauguration. Now here are the most interesting things she's learned so far. From reporting in Kenya to Washington, D.C., and now the dairy land of Wisconsin, Layla Muhammad got the opportunity to see how politics work in America. While working as a reporter in Nairobi, she took a special interest in President Donald Trump and discovered quickly, once she arrived, how different her president and ours communicate on social media. It's been interesting to, to, to just see how a, a president can choose to communicate directly to his audiences without necessarily using the official systems. It's no surprise President Trump likes to communicate on Twitter and while it's a system used internationally, she also learned many people want to talk politics but not necessarily on camera. They're not comfortable to, to express their views which is interesting for me because we know America as the land of the free, those who can express themselves in any way, shape, or form. During her time working at 27 News, Muhammad was able to take to the streets of Madison to talk to voters and soon realize the similarities all reporters face with the job. The same challenges of walking up to people and introducing yourselves, some will ignore you and walk away, some will take time to listen, and even the person who you thought would never even give you a listening ear ends up giving you the best interview of your life. Mohammed says most voters want more input from their government, but end up disappointed. And coming to a new country had its own challenges, but luckily some of those fears went away. There have been so many stories about how people in hijab are treated in this country, so that was my, one of my biggest fears. But I've received nothing but love and, and, and warmth.